Welcome to the Gold Butte National Monument. We have brought our four wheelers with us and we are going to do some ATV riding as well as camping. stove boiling our water making our cup of noodles and we have pudding tonight we have spicy beef um, chicken tortilla and macaroni and cheese cheesy cheddar, cheesy cheddar. oh yeah <laughs> you always well, have to add some meat to it as well get that protein in yep so this is the area we're camping in here. <laughs> Good morning. Morning. What's the plan for the day? We're gonna go ride our four wheelers around. So here was our setup for last night. We have this fine Ozark Trail tent. And then here's our bags. We have two outdoor vital, long and wide um, air mattresses, and then a sleeping pad, and just whatever sleeping bags that we've had. Going right over here, close to our campsite to look for a geocache. Okay, we found it. There to your watch. Couple little birds over there. There's our tent right down there. And this is, I believe, what they call the mud wash dunes. There's a sand dune right over there. And we're up on this rock right here. And all throughout these rocks, there's little hoodoos 
and little arches and all kinds of things. It's pretty neat. Really neat area right through here. This is our first look here at Little Finland. Up on top of this rock outcrop here, a whole bunch of uh, these fins. They make weird designs, arches, all kinds of stuff. So we're going to go ahead and uh, climb up here and get up on top of that rock. Look at this. It's not even connected anymore. This one here looks kind of like a bull. Got the bull's head. No, but I got you talking about it. Whoop, got it. Look at that skull. Don't look at it, it's crap. Oh look, there's a little hole right there in the middle of the wall. So here we are in Little Finland and I think it's kind of like the icing on the cake or the cherry on top or whatever you want to say about Gold Butte. However, this is the only place, we've been to a few places, but this is one of the only places we've been before. So we've got to go down the road and check out some more things. But Little Finland is worth the trip.
seen some of these signs along our way that have a GPS location with your latitude, longitude, and elevation. Get a zoom in of that. I'm sure these signs will be of good use. So as we're driving down the road, we're kind of amazed at how green this desert is. We yeah, also... The, the flowers are blooming. The, everything's green. There's grass growing. It's, it's amazing. Look at all those purple flowers. Really big patch of yellow flowers over there. Look at these Joshua trees. They've all got new growth on them. And some of these things are huge. There's a dead tree there. It's got a hole in it. So something is living inside of it. Those are some sharp rocks. Stopping for some lunch. On the menu today is ham and cheese sandwiches on bagel bits, carrots and celery, and chocolate pudding. So the drive belt broke on this red four-wheeler. I'm going to go get the truck. These guys are going to go play around here for a few minutes while I'm gone. We are at the turnoff to Devil's Throat. So Kayla and I are going to hike out, check out Devil's Throat while we wait. Devil's Throat is. Have any idea? Let's go check it out. Well, that's it. 
I don't know if we're going to be able to see any closer. Um, it's a giant sinkhole. You can see that there's little short stumps of an old fence. That's how close we used to get to it. I remember being able to see down in it. So there's a gate that's not locked. I'm going to walk out there. Makes you wonder how many others are out here. All right, we finished our trip here today. Um, we're back at our campsite, just relaxing a little bit, cleaning up. We were just about done with the day. Um, we were just going to come back here, clean up, and then drive back to where the truck was. And when the belt broke on the four wheeler, we decided to just go get the truck. And then we came. After we got the four-wheeler, we came back here and cleaned up our camp. Anyway, we got that all done. It's uh, all re We're ready to go. We just got to head out. And uh, anyway. Which, which that makes it nice. The roads have been graded and widened. Um, so anybody with any size of vehicle, most likely you would want high clearance to come out here. I don't know if four-wheel drive is needed. There's some sandy places you may need four-wheel drive, but for the most part, you could probably get by with a two-wheel drive. Anybody could probably make the trip with a little bit of high clearance, maybe a little bit of tougher tires. Um, and the highlight really is Little Finland area. Um, we could just spend all day in this area. And I really like the drive on that west road um, that when we were heading south. I really like that drive today. And yeah, nobody was out there. The other road is like a two-lane dirt road. It's wide and anybody can get from Whitney Pockets all the way down to Lake Mead if they want. And it was it was busier a lot. I mean, we saw 15, 20 other people, so it was a lot busier than the other road, but it's still not super busy. Yep. So if Gold Butte is on your list of things to do, make sure you check out Little Finland. You could pass on the rest and thank you for coming along on this adventure. We hope you're having adventures wherever you are. Share them with us. So we made a quick stop at Whitney Pockets and they are, they have some CCC, which is a Civilian Conservation Corps um, in the 1930s, built a couple dams here to help water for, I think it was cattle for rangeland. Um, in the park brochure, it also talked about some Aztec ruins at Whitney Pockets. We're not quite sure where those are, so I guess we'll have to come back another day. There's Kayla going up the dam stairs. So this is the dam from up on top. So here's the side that goes out, and then this is the side that retains the water when there is any. I don't think it works like it used to. There's no water up here either. But that would be cool in the rain to see a big waterfall coming off of there, wouldn't it? <laughs> 